go as slow as shadow on the mic I play to win, never to lose In the contest of champions I'm the one that shoes Swipe straight down, my moves are slick Dexterity more heavily, I dodge quick Class champ, I'm the master of the game Cosmic science, skill tech mutant I claim Arena and chill grind, that's how I roll No stress, no drama, just on patrol The fight, I'm swift, my tactics excite Lost shadows in the arena, ready to ignite From the streets to the screen, my skills are renowned in the world of Marvel, I'm the King Crown. So listen up, here's the story of the champ, Lord Shadow's the name. I'm the Grime Track fan. Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's that time again. We're gonna take a tour through my account. Uh, let's start with my profile so you guys can see. Uh, I have the Elder of the Universe uh, title because that's my favorite, but I have been playing this game for over eight years. You can see here, almost have a 8 million uh, total base hero rating. And I believe all of my uh, champions in the profile are rank threes now. We'll take a look at uh, my rank threes later. And you can see here, and I always like to point out the PvP fights one. I live in the arena. That is where I get my units and so forth. Um, just recently, uh, one of my very big supporters, he's there all the time. He's a member. Uh, Mike Holman said that he will pay for the uh, sigil. And that's why you see me have the sigil now. Just got it. And um, I really thank him for that. He also helped in a major way during the summer uh, sales event. Because I was a little short on units because I uh, got some of those deals. Uh, the four to five gems that were 3,000 units each. I bought like three of those. And then when summer sales hit, I was short by like 6,000 units. Had I not gotten those uh, rank up gems, I would have been just fine with uh, the units that I had currently gotten. But I was close. I was close. And he helped out. And I was able to um, get all the objectives. And I think it, it was like 50 bucks that I, I spent there. All right, um, let's see. Let's uh, let's start with uh, my progression, story progression. Okay, so book one, of course, I have done everything. Book two, I have done everything. And I'm waiting for Act 9 to come out. All right. And let's see. Next, we will take a look. Oh, and I am Valiant. Let's see. Battleground side quests. Um, back issues. I'm going through, you see the classic down there? I'm actually going through these because there are uh, units to be had by doing this. You know, it's not a lot of units, but it's easy units. So uh, I'm going through these as well since I hadn't before. Uh, you can see how many units I have currently. And that's right after the summer sales. We just had the summer sales, right? Um, this month. And I'm already back up to uh, 8,000 units. And I'm at 1 point, was it 1.2 uh, million battle chips? And that should tell you how I'm getting those units uh, primarily. Is the arena. Most grind arena. Yeah, 1.2 uh, million battle chips. Okay.
So now let's go to my roster here. And we're going to start with the seven star rank threes. These are currently my rank three seven stars. Now, um, I have done, let me, uh, hold on before we, we do that. And I know somebody would probably be reminding me, um, the special quests. So I did the shooting stars, hundred percent, the grandmaster gauntlet I've done many times, but, uh, recently, not recently, but, um, I think, what was it last year? They gave more, um, keys and I can go back in and do a few more. Uh, let me see. Will it tell me how many keys I have? Let's see. Yeah. Okay. So I have two keys. So I can go through this another two times. I just never have. Um, but as you can see, I've already gone through and done this. Uh, the only path that I did not do is a path that didn't have any rewards on it. So I'll probably go through that uh, one of these days just to say I did, you know. Uh, and I had fun. I definitely had fun in there. All right. Now, um, oh, wait. I already started. Let's exit out. And I will show you guys. Yep. Eternity of pain, acceptance. I didn't bother uh, doing this. Um, I'm trying to remember. I'm pretty sure I, uh, wait, wait, wait. I didn't do the grief incarnate. I did the, uh, acceptance one. That's right. The grief incarnate, you had to go through just without pausing. Um, and I, and I explored it, but I didn't do like a one shot all the way through. Uh, Necropolis, I've done one path and that's it. Abyss of Legends, I have not gone in there at all. Uh, maybe one day I will. Maybe uh, when we have eight stars or something. Who knows? Uh, and then I've done all the rest here. So the Abyss of Legends is the only content I really skipped. Uh, Necropolis, I am planning on exploring that uh, in the future. And the Eternity of Pain, I did explore it. I just didn't do that optional one there. All right, now let's go ahead back to this. And I have eight rank three seven stars. That Corvus, oh my goodness, that was so lucky. I got him and then I duped him. He is ultra rare right now. In fact, I don't think there's a way uh, currently to get him. You had the option then. Now, um, you might be able to get him later, but right now, no. Uh, Gladiator is my top champ currently, uh, and I am putting Sig Stones into him. He's currently Sig 110. Uh, you can see the bullseye down there. Um, I'd love to awaken him. There's my boy Hulk, Wolverine, Weapon X, America Chavez. Yes, yes, yes. Elsa Bloodstone and Domino. So. I love all of these, obviously, uh, and they've done great, great work for me. Some of them on defense, some of them on offense. Okay, now let's uh, look at my rank twos. Now, these rank twos, currently, it's not easy unless you spend a lot of money to get a lot of rank threes. And so I've had to pace myself with how Kabam has been making them available to us. So right now, any of these are eligible for a rank three, but 
Serpent, for example, is not going to rank three until he is awakened. I currently can't take anyone to rank three. So I decided to focus on getting champs to rank two uh, so that when rank threes come available, they'll all be ready, you know? Um, Photon, definitely. Now, something that uh, you may or may not have noticed, but of my rank threes, all classes are represented here except for one. Tech. So one of these, if I want to make it nice and uh, even, you know, nice even spread, have all classes represented, I, I need to take up one of my tech champions here. Um, Shuri would be definitely a great one. I love Lady Deathstrike. She would also be an option. Guardian is awakened already. Sig 40, definitely an option. Um, and I do have, and we'll, we'll take a look here. These are my rank ones and you can tell from the filter how many I have of each, by the way. So like, for example, I have 12 rank twos here and I have eight, you know, it was easy to tell there. So rank one, I have 54 rank one, seven stars, total 74, seven star champions right now all right so here are my rank ones um spider ham is going up i don't know when uh but soon he's gonna go to like rank two um and you can just see here omega sentinel will be a great one uh wong definitely a good one negasonic uh thing would have to be awakened with a high sig before I took him up because I have the six star sig 200 rank five ascended kindred is another one that won't go up until he's awakened and as you can see here some good ones ant-man I actually want to take up I think people underestimate him vox definitely want him to go up and Sandman. So I have a lot of options for uh, rank two and possible rank threes. You know, Shang-Chi, definitely a beast. He doesn't even need to be awakened, okay? Um, so I'm just lacking the resources at this point in time. I have champions I want to take up, but I don't have the resources to do so. All right, now let's go to the six stars. And let's start with the rank fives. I have 28 of them. And you can see that a lot of them are ascended. I mean, if I'm going to take them up to rank five, may as well ascend them, right? Here you go. So uh, some of them I have as seven stars. And some of them are not available as seven stars. So I went ahead and took them up and uh, ascended them. Uh, recently, I took Toad up for one of the um, challenges that we had. And of course, Hulk, he's uh, maxed out, but, you know, I have the seven star rank three now. And he doesn't really need to be awakened. All right, so that's uh, 28 rank fives. See, rank fours, I have 39. Now, these champions may or may not go to rank five. It depends. Because taking them to rank four means I was planning on taking them to rank five. However, if I got the seven star um, and they're a champion that doesn't really need to be awakened, I'm not taking them up. Like Corvus here. You can see he's ascended, and he was going to rank five. But then I got super lucky and pulled him twice. That was insane. Otherwise, he would have gone to rank five. Uh, Namor, he's still uh, good. Sig 200, 
Um, you can see that little icon right there means he's in war. I actually used him in this past war, and he rocked. All right, um, Kitty Pride. I kept saying she was going to be my first rank five mutant. Well, not so much, and she's still rank four. Uh, but anyway, uh, you can see here, like Wolverine, Weapon X, I already have him uh, ranked up. This is why they're kind of at rank four. Uh, Magneto, I ascended him because I kept ranking up other mutants. And you can see I used him in Alliance War. He also rocked it. So uh, that's the story behind a lot of these. Kindred, I'm actually still using this Kindred because my seven star isn't awakened and he really needs that awakening to be a beast on defense. He can still do it, but without that awakening, no. So when I get the other Kindred awakened, then that Kindred will go up and I'll use that one instead of this one. Um, but that's why I haven't ascended him or anything like that. Uh, let's see, anybody else here? Uh, Gallon, he rocks at rank four. I might take him to rank five. Adam Warlock, I know he's good. I don't really use him all that much. Uh, but in any case, some of them you'll see here, I have them as seven stars. Now, Red Skull, I don't have as a seven star, and I believe he is not in the basic. So I might take this Red Skull up. Maestro, the only reason I didn't take him up was because... Um, you can get the uh, seven star, but who knows when I'm going to do the uh, Necropolis. So I may take him up to a uh, rank five and I might ascend him. I don't know. Um, but these champions here, I don't really use outside of arena or battlegrounds, like in the case of Kindred. Uh, Terax, I will sometimes use and Magneto, of course. Um... Namor, I don't really use, but um, I had a fight where he was just perfect for it. Um, but other than that, I, I should say I rarely use these champions. All right. Let's uh, go down to three. And these champions will probably not be going up anytime soon. If I had to uh, take one of these up, it's going to be one that's not available as a seven star. You know, like Wasp, I still like Wasp, uh, and I might take her up uh, to rank four, maybe. But the sole reason, now Prowler, I am planning to take him up. He is available as a seven star, but I want to use him a little bit more, and I don't use rank threes in... Uh, battle, uh, not battlegrounds in uh arena really. Um, uh, I just started using some of them to get to like win streak five. Other than that, I don't use them in my normal rotation. I use seven stars and my rank uh five and four six stars. So if I want to use these more often in like say the arena, I need to take them up to at least rank four. So he's definitely um an option to take up there. Uh, Ultron, you can get an Ultron, a seven-star Ultron, from the raid uh, in AQ. So I've been hesitant to take him up because I like Ultron, but he's getting a little bit long in the tooth as well. Um, but in any case here, uh, Baron Zemo. Now, some of them I may take up because of the challenge, the um, CCP challenges. Uh, there's one where you need um, to use only Avengers on the team. So like Black Widow here is probably going to go up. Before I do those challenges, I want to have my Avengers, you know, ranked up, if not maxed out for the challenge. Shocker, I actually ranked him down to rank three. He was at rank four, and I got those resources and took someone else up. Um, and then Negasonic, of course, I pulled her as a seven star or else I was going to take this one up. Uh, Atuma, I might take him up. Gladiator, why would I? All right, so 
you know, there's a few that I'm I'm thinking of taking up. Maybe Killmonger uh, for um, defense. Now, no rank twos. I do not take up six stars to rank two. I only take them up to rank three. And I'm now not even making videos on champions that I take to rank three. Only if I take a six star to rank four or five or an ascension or a seven star to rank one, uh, two or three. So here are my six star rank ones. Will I take them up? Who knows? They're here at rank one for a reason. I don't really use them. I may have a seven star version of them like Iron Man right there. Um, or I, I just don't use them. You know, Gwenpool, I still like Gwenpool. And she, uh, I don't think she's available as a seven star. Spider Punk, mm, yeah, no. Um, Captain America, uh, Sam Wilson, I, is he? Yeah, I think he's available as a seven star. Uh, Wolverine X-23, you know, these are champs that are cool. Um, but some of them like, see, King, Groot, Deathless, I have the seven star, so. No reason to take them up except just to use, uh, get some points in um in the uh level up i can't wait for that daily um event to come back the daily uh super event all right so six stars i have 263 and let's look at who i don't have These are the six stars I don't have. There you go. Nice and quick, right? Obviously, some of them are new. Some of them are uh, trophy. You know, they're not available in the basic uh, crystal like Punisher. Uh, and really, the only ones that I'm hunting is that Serpent and Kushala. That's it. None of these other ones am I really uh, interested in. Dust would be nice, but she's available as a seven star as well. So, in fact, let's go back and look at um, the seven stars that I don't have. And there they are. These are the seven stars I do not have. Now, some of these, again, are specialized, like uh, Onslaught, I think, Red Skull, Omega Red. I don't think you can just get them from the basic uh, crystal at this time. Um, would love a spot, but there you go. Those are the champs I don't have as a seven star. All right. Let's uh, go down to the um, five stars. And since I'm already, I got that there, here are the five stars I don't have. Nice and quick. I stopped using five stars except in the um, Catalyst arenas because, of course, you can't use seven and six stars. And I stopped going for five stars so that when I get them in a crystal, it's actually kind of cool, you know, but that's it. These are the five stars I don't have. And let's go ahead and uncheck that. And let's show you my rank fives. I have 137 of them. And then rank fours, I have 27 of them. Rank three, I got 91. Similar to my six stars, I don't really take them to rank two. And rank ones are here. And I got some of these recently, like Serpent. 
I pulled him out of one of those um, Grandmaster crystals. I was surprised. He just popped right out. I said, whoa. <laughs> I said, now, why can't I get a six-star serpent like that? But he's still in the feature. But, all right. Now, let's go to my four stars. I have 269. Now, these, I have 203 that are maxed out. And yes, I do still rank up my four stars. I have 66 at rank four and none at rank three, two, or one. They always go right on up to rank four or five. And those are the champs I don't have as a four star. The leader, who's not even in the game yet, and Thanos, who you can only get from um, special crystals. All right, now the three stars. 266. Five, um, whoops, not rank five. They don't go up to rank five. Rank four, 264. Okay, so only, what is that? Two are not maxed out. No rank three, no rank two, and I have a two that I just recently got that I just haven't taken up yet. I'll wait until, you know, I have a, a rank up that, uh, or a level up that I don't have anybody I feel like ranking up yet. Now, the two stars are interesting. Uh, there's still quite a few two stars I don't have because they're not available uh, easily um, in the crystal. So let's look at the champs I don't have. All right. I have 200 of them, but 68 I don't have. Okay. And I don't want to say all, but most of these are not even available in the regular, like two star crystal. The only way that I used to get these was from uh, Marvel Insider. They would offer a two star uh, champion. And so I was able to get a, a two star champion that I didn't have. And it was really cool. Well, they stopped doing that. I don't know why. But since they stopped that, that was that was it. All right. And then last but not least, the one stars. And I should have all of them. Let's just make sure. Uh, because a couple did get added. Yeah. A couple did get added. And I opened up a bunch of uh, crystals in order to get them. So I have all of the uh, one stars. Got to catch them all. All right. So um, oh, I can show you my relics. That's something new um, that I haven't done in the uh, previous one. Uh, and you hear me sometimes complaining, not really complaining, but you know, going, oh my goodness. That's because look at my six stars. Storm and Scarlet Witch are the only champs I have. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, the only uh, relics that I have awakened. I keep pulling new champ, uh, new relics. So look at this. And I want to rank them up, but I don't want to rank one up, invest all these resources, and then awaken another one. I want to rank up one that is awakened. Okay, so uh, and. I haven't, look, look at this, I have two that I haven't even assigned uh, to a champion. I don't really pay attention too much to that, um, but I need to. All right, so that's why you see me uh, when I pull a new six star, I'm like, I don't believe this. Other than Storm and Scarlet Witch, I just keep pulling new ones. All right, now let's look at, um, and I have 16. Here's the five stars. I'm not going to look at the rankings uh, of these. It don't really. Um, but I got 16. Here you go. And let me see. I believe I have all of these. Nope, I don't. Oh, boy. 
Oh, wow. I didn't realize I didn't have... Wait a minute. See, unowned, five stars. Okay. I didn't realize there were that many. Okay, so I have a lot more five stars. How many of this? Uh, 16? Okay. All right. I, I, I knew I had a lot, but I didn't know that I, I had that many missing. So I can still get some new five stars. Cool. All right. And uh, let's see. The four stars, I have 16 of those. Um, and 16 unowned. Interesting. And the three stars, 16 of those. Hmm. And 16 unowned. That seems odd, but it's nice and symmetrical, I guess. Okay, so that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Take care. Uh, I'll be making another account tour next year, January. So take care, and you all have a blessed day. Arena and chill grind, that's how we roll No stress, no drama, just on patrol In the fight, he swift, his tactics be tight Those shadows in the arena ready to ignite From the streets to the screen, his skills be renowned In the world of Marvel, Lord, the King Crown